switching from trig form to standard form. So what if I have a complex number in trig form and I want to switch it back to our standard form? Well, this turns out to be very, very simple. Simply take the trig form, write it out in its fuller version. So with the parentheses, 4 would be the modulus. And then I'd have in the parentheses cosine 11 pi over 6 plus I sine 11 pi over 6. And all you have to do now is calculate those two trig values. 11 pi over 6 is one of our nice angles. It's 330 degrees. The reference angle here would be 30 degrees, which means I could easily form a quick 30, 60, 90 triangle. Let's see, the 1 would have a negative there in the fourth quadrant. And I can fill in those ratios. Cosine looks to be square root of 3 over 2. And then the sine value looks to be negative 1 half, opposite over hypotenuse. I'll distribute the 4 in. Let's see, when I multiply the first item, 2 will go into 4 twice, leaving me with 2 root 3. And in the second one, I am going to have a minus, positive times a negative. Half of 4 gives me 2. And of course, I'll have the i in there. And I'm done. Here is the standard form a plus bi of that original complex number. Let's look at the second example. I'll tackle it the same way, write it out in its longer version, cosine 200 degrees plus i sine 200 degrees. Let's see, 200 degrees is not a nice angle, so I'm going to end up having to use the calculator. What I should do is first distribute this piece into both parts so that I know what I need to type my real part is going to end up being square root of 7 times cosine 200 degrees and my imaginary part is going to end up being square root of 7 times sine of 200 degrees and then of course this one will have the i with it. We'll obtain those values right off the ti. Let's see I am in degree mode I need to do square root of 7 make sure you exit out of that times cosine 200 and then I need to do the same thing with sine. How about I take the last entry and just change that cosine to a sine. And then I can hit enter there and there's my other value. So about negative 2.5 and negative 0.9. And obviously pay close attention to any rounding instructions, but that's it. Negative 2.5 minus 0.9i. Thanks for watching.